Teenagers are buying guns on the internet, guns that are untraceable and can be made at home. And now police say one of these homemade guns left a Brooklyn Park teenager dead and another hospitalized. Maury Glover joins us now. And Maury, we're now dealing with a homicide from what are known as those ghost guns. That's right. Brooklyn Park police say they've arrested two 17-year-olds in the shooting death of Sayoka Siko. But they say the real issue is ghost guns getting in the hands of teenagers with deadly results. It's been nearly two weeks since Sioka Siko, a member of the Park Center basketball team that won a state championship last year, was shot and died from his injuries a short time later. Now we have a better idea of what led to his death. Brooklyn Park Police say Siko was one of four friends in a car at the Region Apartments on November 18th when they got into a confrontation with two people outside the car. Investigators now believe a 17-year-old passenger in the back seat fired three or four shots at the people outside the car. But he ended up shooting himself and Seiko, who was sitting next to him. We believe the shots were being fired to individuals who were outside of the vehicle, but there's no evidence that those individuals outside the vehicle had a gun or had shot any rounds. Investigators say the teens then drove off to dispose of the two guns that were in their car before eventually stopping near 53rd Avenue North and 94 to call 911. The individuals in the vehicle took time to hide the guns um, and through some incredibly diligent detective work, those guns were recovered. Police arrested two 17-year-olds who were in the car for aiding and abetting murder, including the suspected shooter. When investigators executed a search warrant at the teen's home, they found evidence the teens had recently ordered ghost gun construction kits on the Internet and assembled the firearms themselves with no traceable serial numbers. An alarming trend investigators say is becoming far too common. When we have children that can buy guns off the Internet and assemble them and take a life, Action needs to be taken. Seiko's mother also called on anyone else who was in the apartment parking lot that day to help police find justice for her son. I'm begging for bystanders or people that were outside, whatever, to come and help. Now, Brooklyn Park Police say of the 119 guns they've recovered this year, 26 were ghost guns. In the meantime, the two 17-year-olds are being held in the Hennepin County Juvenile Detention Center, awaiting possible charges. Back to you. All right, Maury, thank you. A golden